Gentle Parenting, Benefits, Drawbacks, and Tips for Practice. Hi, I'm Michelle Risser. I'm a licensed mental health therapist specializing in maternal and perinatal mental health and trauma. Let's go over Gentle Parenting, the benefits, drawbacks, and tips for practice. In this video, we'll discuss what Gentle Parenting is, possible benefits of gentle parenting, potential drawbacks, and six tips for practicing gentle parenting. First, what is gentle parenting? Gentle parenting is a peaceful and positive style of parenting that focuses on a collaborative relationship between parent and child. This parenting style is based on four key components, empathy, respect, understanding, and boundaries. What are the benefits of gentle parenting? The gentle parenting style is beneficial in creating a healthy bond. It benefits both parents and children as it supports working and growing together. Possible benefits of gentle parenting include reduced childhood anxiety, stronger parent-child bonds, reduced childhood anger, positive social skills, increased motivation, and increased emotional vocabulary. Possible drawbacks of gentle parenting include, it can be time consuming. This parenting style requires parents to be active and present to support their children, which can be difficult when juggling other responsibilities. Setting boundaries can be challenging. Setting boundaries can be difficult for some parents if it's not their norm. It takes practice and work. Breaking parental patterns can be hard. Most parents learn parenting styles from their own upbringing, and breaking these patterns can be hard to do. Parents might not be ready or have the support that they need to do this. The style can seem too unstructured. Collaborating with your own child can change the dynamic in the family. Parents and children in more of a position of being partners. For some, this can create a feeling of not enough structure or discipline. Parents need patience to make this work. This style of parenting asks for parents to have patience, and at times this is hard to do consistently. In gentle parenting, consistency and patience is essential. Parents should be ready to be calm in their own reactions and reset their focus in this style of parenting if and when frustrations come up. Here are six tips for practicing gentle parenting. Number one, stay calm. Children will feed off of their parents' reactions. Number two, be consistent. Consistency is important in any type of parenting style, and gentle parenting is no exception. Being consistent with the key elements of respect, understanding, healthy boundaries, and empathy can help the collaborative process. Number three, plan for negative situations. Think about potential negative situations that could come up. This can help you feel more prepared and avoid predictable problems. Number four, set expectations. Being clear with family, friends, and others your family might interact with can help you use your gentle parenting skills with confidence. It helps to have others support you by utilizing those skills as well. Number five, remain positive. Remaining positive is a great way to model for children that even when things may not work as expected, you can try again and again. Number six, work together. Gentle parenting stresses the importance of a collaborative approach and working together in everyday practice. Is gentle parenting right for my family? Gentle parenting may not be a good fit for everyone, but parents can benefit from incorporating elements of it into their approach. Give it a try and see how it benefits your family.